Yo guys, are here, and today I'll be showing you guys um, how to uh, do the Halloween event and everything about Halloween. So I already did this video yesterday. I did record all the stuff, uh, but my fraps didn't record my uh, mic. So yeah, the footage just was just um, in-game sound, and uh, yeah, fuck me. Um, but yeah. Uh, I'm gonna do it again, and hopefully I sound as much powerful as I sounded yesterday. Or not powerful, but happy or whatever. But yeah, uh, I'm gonna cover um, what do, w how to do the outside mission, the spawn location for the outside mission stuff, uh, everything you can get from the Halloween event, uh, vendors, um, and uh, actual event uh, or the Midnight Masquerade. So first thing you wanna do. Uh, you start off uh, in tech wing or going to the tech wing from the uh, monitor womb or um, this main area here uh, and yeah just you get get to the tech wing and you have here uh, east end police station so this is where you want to go uh, to get the the outside mission uh, you can also find um, the vendor or it's not really a vendor but just a box that sells you stuff so yeah uh, the vendor is located um, top right corner of the map I think um, let me just check that yeah top right corner uh, and you can see here seasonal vendor is this box there's not a text above it because it's not like a um, player or character in DC but yeah you just get to the close to the box and you can buy uh, trinkets uh, you can buy styles uh, you can buy like I don't know what this is, consumables, um, and yeah, uh, you, base items, uh, yeah, you basically just uh, get um, get stuff uh, that, that get your feet here, and uh, yeah, uh, so you talk to Phantom Stranger to get the outside mission, and you just accept the thing, and then go to Gotham. Um, you buy uh, items uh, with spooky bites that you get from these missions, so yeah, if you were wondering, uh, yeah, you get those. Alright now, so uh, when I'm outside here, yeah, uh, I'm go just going to show you the route or whatever uh, for farming these um, outside mission things, spawn location or whatever. Uh, so once you exit the police station, you go all the way to the left uh, and when you see the bridge ending, uh, you just turn to the right. So yeah, uh, this is the bridge and you just go to the right. Um, you'll see that like, like this um, uh, little bridge thing and you just go to the left and uh, you'll always pretty much see uh, one here and uh, I'm just going to explain what um, yeah okay so this is the easy uh, type of the like um, mission I guess so you just kill, kill these and you uh, get the mission points or whatever um, uh, the reason you're doing one damage uh, per hit uh, is because if you weren't doing that uh, then you would just one shot them all and uh, I guess that wasn't fun for DC uh, and so they removed uh, so you just do one one damage per, s per hit yeah um, okay so once you're done um, with this uh, thing fire stuff uh, you go under the bridge and go all the way to the end of the bridge. There you should see uh, two of those um, glowy things that spawn ghosts. So one should be to your right and one should be to your left. So currently uh, the left one isn't here but the right one is already being done. So yeah, um, this this one, uh, well I can't explain it really right now but yeah, so somebody already did this. Um, once you're done with uh, with these two uh, you, you go back to the back to the uh, thing you came from uh, under the bridge and then uh, go to the right uh, and uh, it should be uh, here uh, already spawned if uh, somebody didn't do those two uh, at the end of the bridge so yeah th those th that's pretty much the route you do uh, for farming these uh, outside mission things uh, and yeah you should be done in like five minutes uh, max all right so when you see three ghosts uh, that means that you got the second type uh, of um, mission so you will uh, if you, when you kill these ghosts uh, you will see those three balls spawn and you have to take those 
orbs, I guess, uh, and just put them to the people that it shows you to. Uh, now, new people won't do, uh, won't, won't know what to do here. Well, you just uh, throw the ball and it'll get it, get the mission done. Because uh, um, it shows that you have to put it right here, but uh, yeah, you actually have to throw it. Um, okay, yeah. So yeah, that's how you get the mission done. Alright, once you're done with the outside mission, uh, you have to go to the Midnight Masquerade and uh, you just go on a on duty ma menu, uh, you go to the events and uh, just queue up for the Midnight Masquerade. Alright, so once you entered the event, uh, you just uh, talk to Phantom Stranger over here and he'll uh, like get you into the mission um, and then you have to defeat Clarion and you get your reward. Now, while f fighting uh, Clarion, you have to know some things if you want to beat him. I mean, it's not that hard, but uh, it's use useful to know uh, some stuff about him. So yeah, I'll just tell you when the start, uh, when the fight starts. All right. So uh, once the fight starts, uh, you just want to get him uh, low as possible to go into his defensive state, where you can't do damage to him, and uh, then the crystals will spawn and uh, you have to take those crystal to certain locations to get him out of his defensive state so you can uh, do damage to him. Alright, so now he's in... You, you'll see like a shield pop up uh, above his head and uh, also the crystals will also spawn behind you or whatever and you have to take those crystals uh, to like these pillars and that's going to get him out of his um, defensive state and you can do damage to him again once you've done uh, enough damage uh, he will spawn the crystals again and you have to do pretty much the same thing uh, again. Uh, okay, so he's in defensive thing right now. And you have to get the crystal to the pillar right here. Now I recommend you to block uh, if he's in his defensive state and you got the pillar or you're not the one uh, getting the uh, crystal, not the pillar. Because um, he can do a lot of damage and uh, I've seen people getting wiped out at this event and I couldn't actually do the event. So at this point he will spawn the like goats uh, and you will also see like a like that thing over there. Uh, you don't have to really pick it pick it up. You just get the uh, clarion uh, really low and then the crystal that uh, you have to uh, take to the location uh, will spawn uh, next to a phantom stranger. And you see you now he's uh, getting really low and the crystal is right there. Uh, okay, my guy is going to take the crystal and you have to take it all the way like uh, across the room uh, to here uh, Once you've done that. Oh, should I not die? Um, once you do that uh, you just go next to Clarion and uh, you just uh, like I don't know you arrest him I guess I don't know. But yeah, that's the end of the fight and yeah, it's pretty easy um, After he this guy stops talking uh, I'll show you guys the items you can get and uh, uh, How to get them? Alright, so when he stops talking, uh, you just uh, you can leave the mission, or before you leave the mission, you can go uh, next to this um, like vendor thing, and you can buy things uh, here uh, if you have enough spooky bites or whatever, and uh, you can just uh, yeah buy stuff. But I'm going to show you um, what you can get uh, from droppings or drops from the boss. So what are the drops? Uh, not the things you can buy. Uh, so one of the drops are um, Butility Belt and uh, this uh, belt gives you an ability to activate any boot trinket uh, and um, if you have four of them or at least two of them uh, you will bring two boots up or how, how much you have in your uh, belt. So uh, let's say I just click nine and I will spawn all four boots right here. Um, the baby boo, uh, I think it's a drop from this event, and uh, those three boos, uh, Miss Boo, Mr. Uh, boo, and uh, Junior Boo, uh, you can buy them from the vendor over there. Uh, but yeah, 
uh, another drop uh, is the ghost aura that I'm currently wearing uh, it's also a drop uh, quite rare I say uh, from this event um, or the clarion boss uh, I guess he looks okay I don't know it's just ghosts flying around you um, nothing special uh, but it is quite different from the other aura so I guess it's worth trying to get one uh, while you can uh, I don't know if it's going to be uh, available next year but uh, I'm guessing it will be uh, but yeah, uh, this is um, uh, pretty much the whole uh, Halloween event. Uh, I'm sorry if I didn't sound as energetic as I should have sounded. Uh, I don't know. And uh, yeah, if you guys uh, enjoyed this video and this video helped you, uh, please leave a like and I'll see you guys uh, later.